Here's what you need to make the chocolate. 30 grams of sugar. 70 grams of cocoa nibs. Pour half the cocoa nibs into a grinder. Then add the sugar. We're doing half and half because my grind is small. Grind the cocoa nibs until um, fine. Then pour them into a bowl. Repeat with the other half. <laughs> Regrind it in small batches. Make sure it tends to a mud like consistency. The mug like consistency is what you need to make the chocolate. The cocoa butter is beginning to break down out of the cocoa and um, we need to grind it more to make it more liquidy. Now it's becoming a little bit more like mud but I still need to grind it more. I'm working through different um, amounts so it is less likely to clog up the grinder. At the moment I'm levering up the chop the cocoa that's been got gotten stuck under the blade and starting to grind it again. At the moment it's become more liquidy so I'll be taking this out quite soon. Why is it more liquid? It's more liquid because the cocoa butter's come out and um, it's making it more liquidy. Here is the mud-like consistency of the cocoa that I've already ground. Here's the last batch that's going in now. Now grind it till it's less grainy and more liquidy. I'm starting on it now. It's not broken. I'm putting all of my cocoa in now so it becomes more like the liquid that you need. Sorry, coffee grinder. <laughs> oh dear. It's getting much more like the liquid, as you can see. As you can see, um, the cocoa is getting more to a liquidy stage but the coffee grinder is having a hard time so we'll add in some coconut oil or if you prefer cocoa butter now add some 
coconut or cocoa butter so coconut oil or cocoa butter so you don't want to add too much cocoa butter or coconut oil because then it will uh, make the chocolate taste not so nice The cocoa butter will melt with the warm chocolate and make it into a liquid. Oh, look at that. It's almost a liquid now. So, carry on grinding it. There are still a few lumps, so grind those out. As you can see, it's turned to from a solid to a liquid as happens with when you add the cocoa butter or the coconut oil now we need to conch the chocolate and conching is done when your arm aches too much to continue so you must do it as long as you possibly can you i'm using a you have to use a mortar and pestle to do this. So pour all the chocolate into the mortar. Is it? Yeah, I think this is mortar. <laughs> Sorry. Scrape off the chocolate from the sides of your grinder and um, Put it into the mortar. Conching um, coats all the particles and fat and releases the flavour and makes it taste more pure. It's acquired a glossy sheen, but we still need to temper it to make it more glossy and last longer. Now it's time to temper the chocolate. You do this by pouring out the chocolate onto a marble slab. But since I don't have one, I'm using the kitchen cooker because it's smooth. And you pour it out onto the table and you this method is called tabling by the way and then you um you you scrape it up with two spoons to keep the chocolate moving and um or spatulas and make sure that you and it and tempering it makes it acquire a glossy sheen and last longer. Now it's time to test if the chocolate is properly tempered. So you get a bit of the chocolate on a knife or um, a spatula, spatula or a flat surface and run your finger randomly through it if it leaves and an, if it leaves nothing behind then it's fine and it's properly tempered get the tempered chocolate and blob it into the silicone or chocolate mold and you can put something in it if you want to and I'm putting vegan marshmallows in mine you could also leave it as it is Now I'm putting the vegan marshmallows on my chocolate. You can um, put anything on it, but if you don't want to, you don't have to. I am doing it because this is my chocolate bar and what I, this is what I choose to do, so yeah. in a cool place to set and when it's fully set 
um, take it out and, and enjoy. Here are the finished chocolates we have made. So once you've finished with yours, take them out of your mould and enjoy. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Delicious. Love it. <laughs> that was absolutely delicious. <laughs>